Good morning, ladies. This is your girl, Jessica. And I am your sew along host for the Bristol sew along pattern, Bristol sew along dress this week. And today is day two. I'm probably gonna spit my gum out. Hold on, y'all. Give me two seconds. Okay. Be a little clean, you know. <laughs> All right, now. <laughs> so, today is day two. We are constructing our bodies. All right, so I had this whole thing planned on how, I mean, I made a song and everything, and I wanted to record myself, but I didn't want nobody to listen to me. Like, what is she talking about? So I'm going to try to remember how it would go. So I was, no, I was sitting there, I was thinking, we're going to construct the body today. This is going to be fun. So then I wanted to sing a song like, you know, um, um, dang it, I forgot. Construct the body. You pieces. Well, whatever. If I, if I remember it, I'll let y'all know. So, um, I'm posting the video. It will be located in the Day 2 So Along album. I've been seeing y'all um, stuff. Y'all y'all uh, pattern pieces cut out. Thank y'all. I appreciate y'all. I thank y'all. Really thank y'all for just like, you know, rocking with your girl. Because I love doing So Alongs. I love to sit over here and talk to y'all. And y'all talking about me just being, you know, so happy because I am. And y'all, y'all with it. Y'all see, I ain't got the sunshine today. But we are sunshine. So, constructing our bodies today should be, um, it is, I don't think that's going to be hard at all. I don't think it is. I think it's going to be great. Um, I still got to remember my song. I'm excited about it. Because I was like, all right, so today we're going to be striking out, constructing our bodies. Let me figure it out. Okay, so I figured out my song. So, it, it goes like this. Wave your body's pieces in the air and wave them like you just don't care. And if you're ready to construct your body today, everybody say, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, man, I'm telling you, I should get that copyright written, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> so, construct your body today. I will be adding the picture in the So Long Day 2 album. And um, so, go check it out. And, yeah, I guess I'm going to go to work. Y'all didn't know I was. A, I'm a tell. I'm a seamstress by day, and a no, no, I'm not. I'm a. I'm a teller by day, and a seamstress by night. I'm telling you, it's so fun. I'm gonna get out because I think about three minutes now. <laughs> See? Okay, so I have my main and my lining bodice pieces cut. Um, uh, sewn at the shoulder seams. I went ahead and you know pressed my shoulder seams apart. So now grab your lining piece here. We're gonna put this on top of our main bodice, right sides together. If you are adding sleeves to your bodice piece, this is for you. If you are not adding sleeves and just going to do a, um, a sleeveless dress, then I'll tell you what you can, what you'll need to do to make it sleeveless. Okay. So what we're going to do is, if you're going to do, if you're going to do the version that I'm doing, which, or adding sleeves, we're going to pin and sew a half inch seam allowance along the back bodice, both back bodices, this neckline here. using a half inch seam allowance. All right, so if you're gonna use, um, add sleeves, we're gonna sew along here, back bodice, neckline, and the other half, you know, the other side of the back bodice, I mean, of the back bodice. If you're gonna do sleeveless, then you can just go ahead and sew along the sleeves here, okay? You can do that. That's if you're um, not adding sleeves to this pattern, okay? But what we're going to do, take it to our machine and sew, and then I will show you what it looks like when I get back. Okay, so right now I've um, sewn the back in the, and the neck lining, well the neck, and I've already trimmed off one fourth inch of the seam allowance. So now I'm just going to turn it right side out. I'm back here on the back 
bodice of it and just take it get you something that's gonna take that part out this needs to go over and then turn this one out okay all right so i'm turning this right side out and then i'm going to take this to my iron and i am going to press hold on Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this to my iron here and I'm going to press my seams that I've done, okay? And make, you, know, you know, get it to lay good and flat like that. And then I will show you what it looks like and we'll move on to the next step. Okay, so I have my bodice, um, wrong side, I mean right side out and I've pressed, okay? So now we're going to attach our side seams, okay? So this is our front and this is the back of the bodice here. We're going to take the main a bodice only right now, main side pieces, and we're going to match them up with the main back piece here. All right? Hopefully you can see that. So and we're going to pin. All right, and this is our other side of our main. And we're going to put those two together, right sides together. All right, so the main pieces are pinned. Now let's do the back piece here. Okay, this is our, where here is our main front. And we're going to attach to the side here. Just like the other way. Just like we did with the, the main. We're doing the same thing with the lining. We're going to take this to our machine and we're going to sew a half inch seam allowance to attach. I haven't sewn with, with cotton in a minute. That's all I've been sewing with is knit. But it's been a minute. Alright. Now let's take this to our sewing machine and we're going to sew a half inch seam allowance. And then we're going to turn it right side out. And I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so our bodice is done. I've already went ahead and um, I just did a, a little basting stitch on my sleeves here. And now let's get ready for our sleeves. <laughs> 